Uh, hey guys, welcome back to the Iman channel. Uh, I'm Stefan Eichelberger and I have a deck profile for you from the German National uh, where it ended up in the top 16 and here let us show you the deck. Um, I played Dragonlink, Brave Punk and I was really confident with it and yeah, I played two Tracer, one Recharger, one Synchron, one Epsilon Rotor and three Quick Launch for the Rockets. It's a very small engine but I guess it's the best way to play it and sometimes you want to have one more rocket monster but I guess you don't need it and <coughs> I guess I will play it like this every time. Then the two baby dragons and the free car space. In this deck it's not that good um, when you go first and start with it. It's sometimes okay when you get a good discard but when you uh, have to discard a hand trap uh, you think mm, you don't want it to do it and yeah so sometimes I started it out uh, mostly go second and yeah when you go first you can go for ravine and stuff so it's okay but yeah then the brave engine um, I decided to play just two right of Aramazir because I wanted to play 51 cards um, mostly 50 but yeah and so I had to dis uh, had to cut one card and had to decide uh, between one white or one foolish. They uh, thought foolish would be the better option, also with snow and up the rotor. Um, I played three enchantress just because I can milk with Chaos Ruler. And yeah, I also wanted to play one illegal knight just because it's dark. You can add it with uh, faithful this kind for Chaos space, but you don't have the space and. It just happens one time that I missed it at the whole event. Um, then the punk engine. Uh, I just played what they mean because you don't want to normal summit. You just want uh, to have a tailor uh, to start. But, and it's good to bait stuff. It's good to uh, have Chaos Ruler plus Hulk uh, to start your combos. Uh, but if you don't eat, draw a tailor most of the time it's a break when you just draw deer node or uh, just draw foxy you can go for foxy and summon this one and get a free discard fodder uh, with the deer node or it never happens that a tribute summon it um then the rose to egg package uh, in this stick you need it just to go for shooting riser and play go on and it's really a good part in the combo uh, so i like them really much and uh, then for the go second card, two wearer, three ash, three nip, one over, three bomber, a driver, and three droplet. I thought uh, there would be played a lot of combo decks, uh, that's why I played this lineup. And yeah, I also played against stuff like Eldritch and uh, other trap based decks, but I was pretty fine with this lineup. Um, I played against Sun and Balloon and stuff like that when Nip came in clutch, but yeah, <coughs> I guess Nip was the worst hand trap in the uh, on the, the two days, but I still had to, to discard it sometimes with Chaos Base, so yeah, it was okay. And then the last five cards, the one offs, the boot sector and the Ravine, uh, you don't want to draw it, you just want to search it, but Sometimes you draw it and it was like, okay, Ravine is a good draw sometimes to get into your rocket stuff and Boot Sector is, yeah, it's a really brick. Uh, then the one Fairy Tale Snow is cut, should be banned, but I love to play it. It's a good interruption, also if you get Dark Ruler or something like that. Uh, foolish, as I said. And because we have German Nationals, I play one Feather Dust in the main day, just uh, to have a second out from Mystic Mine. Or again, heavy backward deck, but I never drew it, so yeah, doesn't matter. And um, for the extra deck, Christian Striker Dragon, um, IP, Hyperfibrax, Romulus, Dark, and Seal for the Link 2. Uh, some people catch Seal, but um, I guess you need it sometimes when you got hundred tries or something like that and also against the SPI I end when I go for every time with these uh, just to summon the Quarky Mario Drago um, after I force the normal summon and uh, stuff like that um, so that turn is literally over also I got in the last one Dark World he normal summoned Oliver I booked it with Snow and then summoned the Drago and the game was over 
Um, then Unicorn, Access Code, uh, the best part of Borderland playing. Uh, and then for the Zincros, the Shooting Wizard, Chaos Ruler, Savage, and Barone. Um, I tested with Hot Wheels a lot, but in this deck you have to mill um, the Rocket Zincro to go into Hot Red. And also you have most of the time go into Borderland first turn. So I cut it because I most of the time go for Appaloosa and it was mostly better first turn play. Uh, Appaloosa, Savage, Baron and uh, Snow and IP. And then I can go in my opponent's turn into the uh, uh, Borderland and have an extra negate. And also Snow again in the grave. Then we have the Drago. Uh, Draw lock birds against stuff like Dry Tron, and that helped me a lot. Um, <clears throat> the one token collector just for uh, shooting weather to mill it against Swat Soul, uh, Dark Ruler, then Tree Train, one reboot just for the Beko decks, and yeah, also against Anti Spell, it was okay. And I wanted to play one go first card, and we had a lot of options, and in the end, it was Sound Judgment just because I can side it against every deck and it helped also sometimes and yeah, I was uh, really fine with it, it was better than card like anti-spell and yeah. Anyway, that was the deck, 51 cards, top 16 out of 1800 players, I'm really proud of it um, and I have to thank a lot of people for this, first of all I have to uh, thank Event Games uh, so who supported me. Uh, before the event, also during the whole event, it was uh, a nice event with my team. I have to thank a lot of guys at home like Dustin, Avi, Sadi, Paul, who asked me round for round how it's going and <coughs> helped me also before the event uh, with my deck. And yeah, they supported me during the whole time. It was really amazing. Also, there was other guys like Pasha and stuff like that, uh, guys like that who helped me a lot and uh, asked me every round, hey, how it's going? Hey, good luck for the rest. And yeah, and a big shout out goes out to Tom Kleindegreber, who helped me the last three days before he went a lot to get to this list, uh, to have the last card choices. And yeah, he helped me a lot. So a big shout out to him. I love this guy. And yeah, that was it for the deck profile and see you soon.